what's up, Tactical Preppers, Tactical Fan? The show is Brisson. It is um, probably like 12, right? 12, maybe 1230 right now. So I'm going to be talking to you guys about today about um, state, well, state laws versus federal laws on owning a handgun at the age of 18. And yes, this is, yes, obviously magazine is loaded. Um, gun is cleared as you guys can see there's no bullets in here gun is cleared so um so i have a lot of people always message me on youtube stuff like that oh you're oh you're not 21 you can't have a handgun what's the difference can can you own a handgun in this state uh can you do this can you do that oh you can't carry outside the house oh you can't you can't do this there's difference between state laws and federal laws. So, obviously we know that I have a Glock 19X. And I bought this from Gun Show, from a private seller. Now, one thing, especially if you live in the state of Ohio, don't get tricked up by these, um, don't get tricked up by these FFL dealers at these um, gun shows or at, at, or at your regular, um, um, regular FFL dealer. Because... Because I, I wouldn't say I got into an argument, but the lady she tried to argue with me on thinking that she knows the law when I actually looked it up and contacted people who 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 are in the law and contacted USCCA, looked up state laws and stuff, so I know that I'm in the clear that I can buy this handgun. So basically, federal law. Federal law across all states, federal law across all states, you can, um, 18 year olds cannot go into FF. They were thinking about doing it. I'm still, I'm still not sure. And they're going to implement that. It's, it's probably going to take probably two years at most for them to allow 18 year olds to buy guns at, at FFL dealers when I have broke you guys in that news. But, um, but yeah, um, Federal law states that 18 year olds across the whole US cannot buy handguns from FFL dealers. Cannot buy handguns. State law in the state of Ohio says anybody 18 or older can legally possess a firearm. This is classified as a firearm. A handgun is classified as a firearm, shotgun, a sawed-off shotgun, bare 50 cal, uh, AR pistol, uh, AR, um, uh, sub, sub, um, sub machine, well, not sub machine gun, you, you know what I'm talking about, sub, sub compact, um, pistol, so, like an MP5, like an MP5 uh, or Uzi and stuff like that. So, so therefore, Ohio law, Ohio state laws says that anybody 18, 18 or older can possess a handgun. I mean, can possess a firearm. This is classified. This is classified as a firearm under the ATF law. Under ATF. Under the ATF. And under under federal law, I cannot buy this from an FFL dealer. So I can't buy this from Vance, my local gun dealership. I can't buy this from Vance. But state law pro allows me to um and also there's another thing. Uh when I had went in there, I was trying to buy AR lower. This goes with AR lowers also. Um 18 year olds are <coughs> <coughs> Eighteen year olds <laughs> sorry. Eighteen year olds are allowed to possess an AR lower, but federal law states that you can't buy one until you're twenty one because you can convert it into an AR pistol. But but realistically the AR the um the AR low receiver that I was buying had a stock on it and technically I would if I put a shorter barrel on it, I would be converting it into SBR, which I would need a tax stamp 
from the ATF, so it will be classified as an SBR short barrel rifle. So, um, they're they're actually thinking about selling me the um the uh, AR lower, but they was like, you know what? We don't want to get in trouble as a dealership because say that you do turn this into an AR pistol, then we are liable for that. So I understood that and I said, you know what? Okay. So I end up going to a gun show, end up buying this. I cannot buy this from Vance. Because they are FFL dealer, they abide by the ATF laws, abide by federal laws, which I can't buy. But state law says otherwise and says that I can possess a firearm, that I can possess a firearm in the state of Ohio. So, and it also says you cannot buy from an FFL dealer, you can buy from a private seller. You can buy from a private seller. Or you could have a family member buy you the gun and then they could gift it to you. Another thing that uh, I seen at Advance, um, somebody asked if you could gift somebody a firearm. The dude was like, no. Uh, one of the uh, dealers was like, no. And he's wrong about that. He's wrong about that. In the state of Ohio, we are legally allowed to... So, so if, if I was... All right, so say my brother, my brother's 21, right? Say he bought me, say he bought this from Vance, right? He's legally allowed by state law, by state law, saying that he can gift this gun to me. And then he could, he could literally gift this gun to me. And it's my gift. It could be for your birthday, for Christmas, for whatever holiday. So, and state and state law says that. So, therefore, that's how you can work around these restrictions. So, I will always say call USCCA, um, ask them, um, ask them if since I'm 18, can uh, I, I called probably about like five different representatives from, from USCCA, making sure that I can buy it. And I've called other people to, um, to make sure that I can legally, um, possess this. Um, firearm in the state of Ohio. Every state has different laws. Every state has different laws. And when it comes to carrying also, when it comes to carrying outside the house, we just have, we just uh, got the constitutional carry law where people 21 and older can conceal carry. Now, in the state of Ohio, people 18 and older, people 18 and older can open carry. Therefore, if I wanted to walk outside this house and open carry this gun, open carry this firearm, I have the right to because I'm I'm in all legal standing laws. I'm allowed to possess this firearm in the state of Ohio because I'm 18. I'm I'm allowed to open carry this gun open carry this firearm in the state of Ohio because I'm 18. I just can't conceal carry until I turn 21, which I won't need a CCW for. So that's how you can work around it. And also look up state law, see if, see if okay, if this, can this person gift me a firearm? Because, you know, um, because, yeah, there's this girl. Oh, yeah, there was an 18 year old girl who was working at Vance. She was like, I can't even buy a handgun. I was like, well, I was like. Well, I bought one. Does like well, you didn't buy it legally. I said, I said technically, state law says says that I can legally buy buy a handgun, buy buy a firearm from a private seller at a gun at a um at at a gun show, and that they can't do background checks. She, the the older lady, she's like, they have to do background checks. No, they don't because they're a private seller. They're selling their own personal gun. If I went to an FFL dealer. At a gun show, I would need to fill out paperwork, and there's a paper trail. But me going to um, me going to a um, me going to a private seller at a gun show, there's no paper trail. Easy, you could use cash or you could use card. Easy, get in, get out, and now you have now you have a firearm. And now you have a firearm. Um, that's one thing that I. 
think we suffer as a gun community, suffer as a firearms community as a whole. We're all not on the same page and we all don't know the same things. That's why I have a channel like this, which I can put out onto a platform and tell people information that they might not know or might not have heard of. So if you ever run into a problem, especially if I ever ran into a problem with the law, open carrying this gun, open carrying this firearm, I'll, I'll say state law says, I'd like you could look it up too. State law says, I don't know what bill it is. State law says that an 18 year old can legally carry a um, open carry a firearm. And state law also says an 18 year old can have any firearm can legally possess a firearm in the state of Ohio. So that's how you go about it. <laughs> that's how you can go about go about working your situations, but also know your laws, never back down from what um never back down into getting into a debate about about why you can have something because you know people are always going to tell you that you can't have some and especially at um uh gun dealerships um because Especially when I went to um, the shooting range, dude said your mom has to claim this as your, as as her as her firearm. You can't go into the shooting range by yourself with this firearm. I said I said, well, technically, I know y'all are federally go by the ATF and by federal law, but in the state of Ohio, I can legally own it. And then he, he looked in disbelief. He was like, he said, I've been working in this community for 20 years. I've been, I've been in the gun community for 20 years. I've never heard something like that. Uh, you cannot own a hand. And he was like, you know what? I don't care what you have outside, outside and personal use, but you can't have it. And then he told somebody else and the dude, I believe that was his boss. The dude, the, uh, the other dude said that I could go into the shooting range by myself. He he got mad because I know what I'm talking about. He got mad because I know what I'm talking about. And, you know, some people, some people, you know, p older people try to take advantage of younger people thinking that younger people don't have knowledge and don't know what they're talking about. And, you know, I think that's also where we suffer as a community. When we have younger people, 18, 18 years old, when we have young people coming into, into the firearm community and you have all these old heads having all these old laws instilled into their mind and they're not they're not receiving new knowledge of new laws and stuff like that. I think that's where we're suffering as a firearms community as a whole. And that's pretty much it for this video. Um that's why I can legally own this handgun in the state of Ohio because of state laws. State law trumps over federal law. Now, if I was to cross into another state, I would have to I would, I would have to check their state laws to see if I'm legally allowed to possess this firearm in their state as an 18 year old. Because then, if I'm not, then federal law federal laws would take into effect. But here in the state of Ohio, state laws rule over federal laws when it comes to 18 year olds possessing firearms. And that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys learned something new. And yes, I do have new bullets. Uh, these are Sig Sawyer's um, hollow points, um, 120, 124 grain um, bullets. So yeah, as you guys can see, hollow points. And this is for my EDC and for home defense. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I hope you guys learn new information and stay tactical.